Oi, oi, everybody! Howdy, doody, tooty, fruities! Hello, 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 hello. You know what it is. That's all you get. So today is obviously create this book too. We are doing two prompts, but they are going to be sort of one piece. So we will get into that now. We are doing create positivity, fill this page with positivity. And then we're going to do the next page as well. Create negativity, fill this page with negativity. I have an idea for this. I don't know whether I can pull it off. Uh, <laughs> but I guess we will see. This is... Gonna stress me out because it's drawing human beings again. Which... Ah! I hate drawing them and after this I vow to never draw humans ever ever again. I just can't get my brain wrapped around drawing them. I can sketch, I can like as in look at a photo and sketch it out now. I'm getting good at that. My characters are improving, my like drawings improving but can I draw a human being? No. This is your reminder to hit that subscribe button. I really really need you to hit it. Help a small YouTube channel out because all YouTube wants to do is help the bigger channels which they don't need the help we need the help the smaller channels need the help not the bigger channels but yes anyway <laughs> so you'll see me here trying to figure out how to lay these hands out because I'm trying to make a heart shape with my hands in this drawing but I found it very hard because I have what I assume is double jointed thumbs I don't know because my nan always used to say that I lost a fight with a thumbtack. Um, because they bend back too far. And even the other day, my partner called them your weird thumbs. How offensive! <laughs> so, the hands gave me a bit of jip. The, it's mostly the faces that I can't draw. Hands, I can sort of get, but the proportions to the hands to the face... It's meant to be like when you put your hand on your face, it's like your whole face. So therefore the hands of the face should be about the same size. But This is the positivity page and all I do is be negative. Because I do believe I throw a paddy after this and give up and go away for <laughs> a good few days. Because join humans. That's why I vow never to do it ever again. I I really, really despise drawing human beings. It's I detest it. I can't do it. I just can't do it. I try and I try and I try and they always come out looking the same. They don't improve. No matter how many art videos I watch or anything like that, I just can't. I quit. <laughs> Spam creates not human beings. <laughs> Look at that. That is scary, right? Did you see that face? I, I rubbed it out straight away because it's it it creeped me. It creeped creeped me out. It's meant to be a self-portrait. 
And damn, if I look like that, I'm... One, need my eyesight checking. And two, need some surgery. <laughs> I'm scary. I promise I'm not that scary in real life. I well, at least I don't think so. And I have recent, well, not recently, but um, my hair is shorter than the other self-portraits that I've done in this book because I have chopped it off. I keep my hair's very thick, so I keep it long for winter because it keeps my neck warm. <laughs> but now that it's summer in the UK, we're uh, I've chopped it off. <laughs> but we've moved on to the negativity page now. This one was a lot easier to draw because my face is covered. <laughs> but you will see this improves, don't panic. <laughs> so the idea behind this page you get a hint there. So the positivity page is a normal photo, but when I go onto the negative page, it's going to be a negative, as in like a photo negative, or <laughs> I'm going to try and do that. <laughs> Whether it'll come across, I don't know, but I'm also going to put on here self-love, self-hate, self-hate from the negative side, obviously. I'm not exactly happy with this. I that negativity one needs perfecting a little bit more. Perfecting, <laughs> like my artwork's perfect. And I'm still a little creeped out by positive. But I won't put you through any more of that hell. <laughs> I'm gonna go line this and refine it a little bit. And maybe go get some fresh air after stressing about this human being thing for... Oh my god. Even now, even though I've finished it, oh, I can still feel the anger and frustration. <laughs> I'm like, I need to go calm down before I rip this book to shreds. <laughs> So I'm going to go have a, like, midi breakdown. <laughs> Not much changed on this one, to be fair. Yeah. Punch it in the face. Yeah, I've drawn, I think I've drawn self-portraits of myself three times in just create these books and they're all different. There's no consistent way that I look. <laughs> <laughs> you get the general idea. I'm, uh, I'm a brunette. <laughs> That's about the only consistent thing. blue eyes that I think that's another consistent <laughs> and you know what well, <laughs> I noticed after I finished this um, I have a lip piercing that I've had probably for over 10 years and I just forget that it's there and then I realized the other day in drawing and looking at all the self-portraits that I've done. I never put it in. Because <laughs> I forget that it's there. I thought it was funny. That there's a bit of metal on my face that I, I always forget about. I went through a stage of piercings. I had them all in my arm. And then my neck and my back. <laughs> anyway. We're moving on to my lovely hoodie. This hoodie is... 
I have it in this colour and a grey. The grey one I've worn out on the elbows and the zip is broken. I have to take it off over my head. I love that grey one. But this blue one is like oversized and so comfortable. <laughs> I just made those eyes even creepier. We're going to... This is positivity page. What's positive about it? The hoodie looks good. My hair's closer to my normal colour, I think. Except for I've probably got a little bit more grey hair. <laughs> ah, funny. I just have to keep testing out. So the colour and that is done on this side. So we're going to move on to this side now. Um, but we're going to just... We're not going to line it with black pen. We're going to go in with white pen. Because obviously this is a negative side. So we have to switch it all. I do change this design. I bring my hood up. To make it a little more emo-y. <laughs> If you want to know how I did it, um, I basically took a photo of the previous drawing and used a negative filter on my tablet so that I could see the exact colours and match them exactly. Which, in the end, I don't think I did a, a bad job at all. It kind of works. If you take a photo of the negative side and switch it, back to normal it looks normal like the colors are good <laughs> so i am co like covering up that prompt i'll know what it is when we do a tour or whatever it was just in the way and it looked stupid on the when i was flipping it it was irritating me that it was there so i did sort of cover that over with a scrap piece of paper and then just drew the design over it. I was so scared to do this because the white pens just give me so much jip. Oh. Getting the skin tone right was also one a shock to me because I didn't think that I'd be able to match that colour. But I really did. Nailed it. So obviously black lines would be white lines so I'm having to use this white liner for the line art which we don't get on but it did surprisingly well on this. I just had to figure out whether I should line it, then colour it, or colour it and just leave a gap and put the line art in. But I think I did like a mixture of both in the end. Trying to add shading as well, which was interesting because obviously it would be backwards. The where you'd put the darker for the shading, it needs to be the lightest colour. Which my brain was like, this is wrong, it's wrong, it's wrong. <laughs> but you'll see in the end that it is it is right. Um I was so obsessed with this idea, I got it in my head and I just had to do it. But when it came to it, I was like, can I execute this? <laughs> I don't think I can. So this did take me about a week because one, stressing about drawing humans, so that took about three days on its own. <laughs> The colouring of the positive side was fine. The negative was like, how do I even approach this? 
and then obviously lettering is another thing that I don't get on with so that took like another day <laughs> I'm joking I'm joking I'm joking I'm joking it doesn't take me that long I swear <laughs> self-love self-hate now I've not like my whole life I've been a not a negative person but I've had a lot of negative things happen to me so I have a negative sort of not an, it's like when something happens I know it's gonna be like the worst because it's my life so <laughs> Oh, I hate myself. <laughs> I've been through a lot. <laughs> it's the best way without going into my whole life story. But I've been through a lot. And I've had... Not a bad life, but at the same time... not the bestest life it's improved don't get me wrong like i've worked my buttocks off to do it but i am improving and i'm improving myself by not being so hateful of myself it does creep in more than i like but at the same time silencing that voice in my head that tells me I'm an idiot and all this stuff and all the negative things people have said to me <laughs> like this is what I'm putting on this side fat so you're so emotional get over it you're so stupid it hurts like just be careful what you say to people like I really can't emphasize this enough words do hurt especially people who are already anxious and not confident or anything like that just because your life's great and you have the the strength to be you other people can't other people will have to like give themselves pep talks before they leave the house and i am one of those people like i walk my dog and i have to take an anxi anxiety fidget spinner thing because I'm just anxious of people <laughs> but on the other hand I do have to say I I am strong I've survived a lot and okay some people might say that I care too much I get like emotionally involved but at the same time I know what that person is going through so I don't know. All I ask is you please, please, please just mind your words, think about what you're going to say and the effects that it could have. But as you can see, my positive negative did work. <laughs> and I'm very proud. Yay! Yay! Me! <laughs> I hated creating this one. But I love the end result with a positive negative. I think it works beautifully. Where am I going? Oh, I was trying to see if there was like another quick one that I could do because I felt like I had cheated you out two prompts, but I technically did two prompts. But there's nothing sort of quickish that I can just do so we're gonna stick with that i hope you enjoyed i know it was a bit weird this one but again just think about what you're saying to people and if you are like me then you're not alone and i am always available so if you do want to chat to me i am on instagram spam underscore creates um i I'm here to listen if you need to or if you need help with anything I'm there does that make me a fool no it makes me caring and if I didn't want to help you I would probably not say it but at the same time I would do everything in my power to help anyway 
If you enjoyed this video, uh, please give it a thumbs up. And will you subscribe, please? Pretty please, with a cherry, well, with a will you on top. <laughs> He's on the self love page because we love will you. And the fact that he's joined the subscribe team just helps me even more. Because <laughs> it's not just me asking, it's cute little will you. Anyway, I will stop talking now and I will catch you in the next one. Bye! Subscribe!